What is good? Thursday classic. Let's get it. What's good? Still spinning. Really just trying to share my thoughts, share my ideas to help you guys live the life that you love because that's what I love to do. I love living my life and I love helping others. I'm actually a certified life coach now, so let's get it. We're continuing with the book Living in Flow by Sky Nelson Isaacs, Mr. SNI. And uh, I'm on chapter two. This section was amazing. And I'm actually finished the book, but I'm going to try to show you all the parts that I find meaningful. So this today is called The Basic Model of Meaningful History Selection. The premise of meaningful history selection is that the world we experience in everyday life is a specific set of circumstances drawn from a multitude of possibilities. The possibilities that could come to pass can be visualized as existing on a tree. Our lives get shaped in different ways depending on how we navigate the tree. So if you can visualize a tree with different branches, every choice you make, every action you take puts you on a different branch. So if you think of it that way, you can kind of take those bold actions to be shifted on the branch that you want to be on, put yourself... Um, in the probability of the outcome you want. That's kind of what I said in a past podcast, but this is getting deeper into it. In this model, regretting missed opportunities doesn't make any sense because opportunities only unfold in response to the choices we actually make, not the ones we could have made. I really like that. The point of meaningful history selection is to navigate through the tree toward apples that reflect our intent. To navigate in this way, we don't just choose where we want to go and go there. After all, the branches on the tree don't represent actual places. They represent situations. Moving around the tree involves making decisions and acting upon them based upon our thoughts, feelings, and emotions, which are three different things. He basically explains how they're very different things. But he explains further in the book, so hopefully I'll get to like a better description of the difference between those. It is not a specific experiences that our body tunes into, rather the qualitative nature of those experiences. It is the qualitative in the sense that it didn't happen as you literally expected, but it did match the qualitative nature of your intention. For example, he explains later in the book that this girl is rushing to to get to a show on time. And for example, the qualitative experience is what her thoughts, feelings, and emotions are. Maybe she has um, an emotion of meeting people at the show or what he describes as maybe a smell or a taste of popcorn is that qualitative experience she really wants. Just a simple example. And she's, she's, she tries to rush to the show, but she misses the show and she gets, she sees a movie across the street where she goes and she's always wanted to see or been wanting to see. And she has that popcorn. So the point is she got to the intention of that qualitative experience of smelling or tasting the popcorn, but not in the way she intended. So that's kind of how you have to think of things. And he explains what I wanted to say right now way better. So I'll just say it right now. This is certainly not easy because it relies on the hardest thing of all, self-knowledge. In order to make consistent decisions in harmony with our lives and our communities, we must be able to feel our feelings accurately and relate to others authentically. Instead of thinking your choices don't really matter in the big picture, you might realize that important things happen wherever you choose to go. I'm skipping around. These are all different parts that I underline because your boy's studying this book. So I'm just trying to pick out the nuggets. All right. Um, if your choices, I said this quote the other time in the other podcast, but it's so impactful. And now we're back up to this section. So here we go. If your choices shape your world, then it's pretty difficult to feel insecure about your importance in the world. After all, if the cosmos is responding to you, then you are important. You may not feel happy with your circumstances and you may feel insecure about your talent, preparation, intelligence, or appearance, but you can't possibly feel unimportant. The cosmos is forming itself around each of us. And that's a crucial role we play. And lastly, you must know yourself well enough to know whether the experience you're building toward is the one you want to have. Instead of questioning your decisions and looking outside yourself to determine whether you have made a good decision, you will see exactly what type of experience your action is building toward and know right away whether it is what you intend. So it's pretty crazy that I'm reading this book now because I just became a certified life coach. I'm, I'm working I'm working towards making that my full-time business, and it's just incredible. And I feel like I've been doing that, and it took a long time for me to get clear with myself and really be myself, and that's exactly what led me to this life coaching because I actually really love helping others. I took a survey at work that actually defines myself really well, like on the nose. So I might read that in another podcast, but I truly love helping others, inspiring others to do their best. I love interacting with people. So I want to help people be themselves because in my life, that's what I was struggling with at one point. So now I feel so much happier. I feel on my path. I feel synced up. I just feel great. So if you want to to help define your core value so you can make these moments happen and find your path, that's exactly what I love to do. So hit me up, stevenselly.com. 
for all your needs and wants and also more uh, content. I got more videos coming soon and I might even, I'm hopefully having more guests on soon. Let's get it. Enjoy your day. Five minutes deep. Not bad. (laughs) Let's go. I'm loving doing this podcast. Enjoy your day. Toodaloo. Woo!